I'm Marquis Mapp for Smart Trend News. Latin American shares are mostly lower, dragged down by weak U.S. markets. In July, U.S. private sector payrolls rose by an estimated 71,000, the Labor Department said. That's shy of the 100,000 jobs that economists had expected on average. Overall, the economy lost a net total of 131,000 jobs last month, the Labor Department said Friday, mostly because 143,000 temporary census jobs ended. U.S. shares slumped on the news. The disappointing monthly U.S. jobs data overshadowed tame inflation on Brazil. Brazil's consumer prices, as measured by the benchmark IPCA index, rose 0.01% in July, according to the National Statistics Agency. The increase, which follows a flat reading in June, was less than the median forecast of 0.02% inflation in a Bloomberg survey of 35 analysts. 12-month inflation slowed to 4.6% from 4.84% in June and continues to support speculation that the central bank will soon stop raising rates. Around the region, Chile's stock market, though, managed to stave off the bad news in the United States and focus on its own good news. Chile's consumer prices rose 0.6% in July from June, the National Statistics Institute said, lower than the 0.7% median forecast of 17 economists surveyed by Bloomberg. Annual inflation quickened to 2.3% matching estimates, while underlying monthly inflation, which excludes food and fuel, was 0.6%, the Institute said. Brazil's Bovespa was last down 0.96% at 67,757.33, and Mexico's IPC down 0.21% at 32,838. Chile's Market Select Index gained 0.17% to 4,448. I'm Marquis Matt for Smart Trend News. For more news and market analysis, visit our website, tradethetrend.com, and subscribe to our YouTube channel, Trade the Trend.